Hey guys, this is Salamander Anagram with ReactorTutorials.com and in this video I'll show you how to build a simple oscilloscope like the one here that shows a single cycle of a waveform. I use this mainly for testing new oscillators that I'm building. Um, it can be very useful just to make sure that everything's working the way you think it is or just when you want to see what something looks like um, when you're testing uh, building something new. So I have my scope embedded inside a macro that has two inputs and zero outputs. First input is the pitch input. It's going to be controlled by our incoming note pitch and we want to use it to control a ramp module which you can find in the oscillator menu. The ramp only accepts a frequency input so we need to translate from pitch to frequency using the exponential F module. Next we can give our ramp a constant amplitude of 1 and sync it using the incoming MIDI gate. We're going to use this to control the X input of an XY module which you can find in the panel, panel menu. You can set in the view tab of properties can set the XY module to have an object type of scope and now we have it in oscilloscope mode and um, so our ramp will control the X input and it's going to basically draw from 0 to 1 across the screen horizontally and we'll use our incoming audio as the Y input it's going to determine the um, as we're drawing across the screen the Y input is going to determine how far up or down we are. We also want to turn the Y minimum value in properties to negative 1 because our audio signal is going to have a range from um, negative 1 to 1. Um, just a few reasons why I'm not using the built-in scope module. Um, first of all, um, if I set it to always active, you can see it's a mono only module. Um, you can only use it for monophonic signals, which I don't really like. Um, the XY module also has a little bit more going on in the view section. Um, you can set it transparent, which means you can layer them on top of each other, which I find to be very useful as well. And I just find the scope to be a little more confusing than this simple structure that we have here. If you want to um, wire this up to a simple oscillator, it's very easy. I'll use the triangle sync as a example. So I'm just going to use the pitch that's controlling the oscillator. We'll also go into our macro as well as the output from our oscillator. I'll sync it to an incoming gate and I'll also control the amplitude with a gate and this will just give you the ability to um, look at your waveform as if you're building a new one or something and to um, notice any mistakes that are being made. Once again this is Salamander Anagram with ReactorTutorials.com hope you guys enjoyed this quick tutorial and I'll be back with a new one next week.